Hi Dr. Adil, can you please explain all about inflammatory breast disease? So, what do you mean by inflammatory breast cancer? When we think of a normal invasive breast cancer or what we say the conventional breast cancer, we associate it with a painless mass which is gradually increasing in size. But inflammatory breast cancer is a little different. So how? It usually presents with swelling and redness of the skin. There may be warmth of the skin which usually involves more than one third of the breast. So the other characteristics include it progresses over a short period of time. That is, it is a very aggressive type of breast cancer. So when we think about inflammatory breast cancer, we see it in the younger age group and it also has a very aggressive outcome. So now when we think about the treatment for inflammatory breast cancer, how is it different from conventional breast cancer? Like I already mentioned, it is quite aggressive. So naturally the treatment has to be aggressive. So there are certain changes that we do or how we tailor our treatment to treat inflammatory breast cancer. So there are three modalities of treatment in any cancer as we know. One is a chemotherapy, radiotherapy and surgery. So when we come to chemotherapy part, probably in the conventional breast cancer, maybe some of the patients in a very early stage could have avoided chemotherapy, but that is not the case in inflammatory breast cancer. Almost all patients of inflammatory breast cancer do need chemotherapy because of its aggressive nature. The same goes with radiotherapy. All the patients of inflammatory breast cancer who have a localized disease confined to the breast do require radiation. And the same goes with the surgery. Even the patients who have inflammatory breast cancer should go modified radical mastectomy, that is, removal of the entire breast rather than a part of the breast. So this is regarding inflammatory breast cancer. In a nutshell, it is an aggressive tumor, younger age group. The treatment is more aggressive. Chemotherapy, surgery and radiotherapy, all three form an integral part of treatment of inflammatory breast cancer. It is seen with more redness. It can be confused with infection. So we need to be careful. So we need to have a higher degree of suspicion for a patient who has redness and tenderness of the skin who has not responded to the conventional antibiotic course. Thanks a lot.